Hello, hello everybody. Welcome on in. I am Ori. We are back with some more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor. Today we're going to run what I consider one of the most OP builds in the game. We're going to run Salt Pits, uh, Hazard 5. We're going to run Gunner and we're going to run Heavy Gunner. And what we're going to do is we're going to run the Thunderhead. Uh, we're going to run the Shard Diffractor. We're going to run the Arms Core Coil Gun. And then we'll probably run the Burst Fire or the tactical lead burster as our fourth gun. It's gonna just depend what shows up. I think those guns are both kind of interchangeable because they're gonna do sort of the same effect. They're gonna do an AOE damage. I, well, I don't know if AOE is the right word. It's gonna shoot around us. It's gonna be a surrounding weapon that's gonna do damage to a lot of different enemies all over the map. So those weapons I think are interchangeable. We're probably not going to be able to level them up enough to get them to piercing. But that would be ideal. But that would also mean we're going to need to get four overclocks. We'll see. I'm going to prioritize the Thunderhead, the Shard Diffractor, and the Coil Gun, though. Those are going to be our main focuses that are going to make us the strongest in this game. So if anybody's struggling with beating... Um, if anyone's struggling beating any Hazard 5 difficulties, this is going to be the build you're going to want to run. Uh, it's going to be incredibly strong. We're going to clear through probably any any Hazard 5 difficulty, uh, especially on this. This is going to be a good a good build for um, Hollow Bow 2 because with the arms coil, with the arms core coil gun, you're going to be able to shoot through. Um, through all the vines, and that's really important on a level like that. Um, okay, so we're gonna have to re-roll these. I would prefer the coil gun second, but we'll take the shard diffractor. Ideally, we get three guns overclocked here. That's the ideal scenario. We get the shard diffractor, we get the uh, thunderhead, and we get the, the arms core coil gun. That's the ideal scenario. Uh, we all know it doesn't always work out like that, but we'll see. Swarm detected. Get ready. They'll be with you shortly. Okay, let's mine through this and come back out this way. Let's drop this on all these guys right here. All right, so let's do the pickup radius. All right, we need to make sure we're completing our quest here too. And then let's go get this supply drop. Boy, feel quite alive. Luckily, we just have to mine through salt and not actual rock. Okay, let's do the damage. Um, ideally, we want to get piercing first on this Thunderhead. That's... That's going to be super important, I think, for us. Okay, we'll do... Let's do the gold, because that's going to be really... Going to work really well on this map. Um, let's do the damage. Okay, let's go get some more resources. More nitro. I, know, I think there's some more nitro at the top of the map. But there's got to be some down here, too, right? Guess not. I'm not, I'm not trying to mine you. I'm trying to walk through this. We're going to try to hold off killing the bosses as long as we can. Especially since I need to complete this quest still. Well, actually, I guess I'm about to complete the quest right now. Okay, so quest complete. Let's go back up here and see if we can get that Nitra. Okay, let's do the armor. We're getting pretty bad upgrades here, to be honest. We're getting hardly any weapon upgrades and we're getting mostly just these low level universal upgrades which is not really going to be that beneficial yeah. for us our build is going to mainly revolve around overclocking these strong weapons okay well i guess i have to take the legendary xp gain right there okay let's bump this guy up three because i feel like we are a little bit behind I want to be at least low 20s by the time we complete this. Uh, I think that extra XP is really going to help. Okay, we're going to do the extra beam. Okay, 
So at this point, we're basically just gonna farm XP. Let's see if there's anything up here in this corner real quick. No, okay. So yeah, we're just gonna do loop-de-loops now and farm this XP. I'm sure there's another Nitra node somewhere. But at this point, I think I just want to do, um, let's do the reload for our heavy. At this point, I think I just want to farm XP. I think that's going to be more beneficial for us. Okay, so we're going to reroll these because they're, I, we are, I do want the burst fire, but I want to make sure we get the coil gun. This is a lot of rerolls. Don't do this. Don't do that if you're me. Don't if you're you playing this game, don't do that. Don't don't waste all your gold on rerolls like that. Just don't. This is me this is me trying to do the strongest build possible. I just wasted probably a hundred gold right there. That is not an ideal scenario. But what's the point of trying to show off the strongest build if I can't get the weapons I want to get? Okay, we're gonna do the weapons again. All right, let's do, we're definitely going to do, man, oh my gosh. I, I was just going to say, we're definitely going to do beam range. But the only beam weapon we're really going to have is the coil gun. But getting extra range on that is insanely good. Uh, but the pickup radius, I feel like we should pick. Man, that's tough decision right there. I'm hoping that we can get the range at other points, because who knows how often. I want it. Okay, so we got piercing right off the get. That that's incredible. That actually might make us too strong, but we can't pass it up. All right, let's do a coil gun. I want to get. So now the plan is to get all three of these guns overclocked, so we can get a bunch of beams and a bunch of damage with our with our thunderhead. Okay, see, now we can do the range. Cool. Getting range on this uh, coil gun is really, really, really strong. Like, it's it's insanely strong. Okay, let's do the reload on that. Fortunately, we're not going to be able to get all that XP, I don't think. Yeah, because this is, this is too far away. Okay, and then last, okay, the, the fire burst was the one I said we could get, so let's get that one. And then let's make sure we get on the ship. And then we'll hang out here and see if we can get some XP. It's not bad, level 25. Uh, we did definitely started off a little bit slow on our weapon upgrades. I would have liked to have seen a little bit more. Okay, so I'm actually not going to buy these legendaries. Uh, especially for this gun, because this gun's kind of our last choice here for level ups. So I think we're going to take. Well, let's see. This is yeah, that's too much. That's 56. So I can't afford two of these. So we're going to do you. And then we're going to do you. And then unfortunately, I spent all my gold rerolling. So we're broke. That that's a pretty well, I wouldn't say that's a huge setback because we did spend all our nitra anyways, but we definitely lost out on some um, gold upgrades. So not the worst thing in the world, but it is a it is a setback. OK, let's do I want to do I actually think I'm OK doing these other guns because now that we have piercing. Since we got piercing on our Thunderhead, I think I'm okay kind of putting that one a little bit to the side. Just for a little bit, if there's better upgrades for other weapons. So I do want to get extra beams on this, uh, on our coil gun. The scanner just lit up like a Christmas tree. We got a swarming coming. Can't drop supplies for you yet. Let's get all this nitro. We're going to take some hits here. That's okay. Let's go. 
Okay, oh. <laughs> okay, let's do... I'm gonna do the weapons, because we're gonna focus on those mostly. Um, do we want to do the pickled nitra? Or do we... Don't we already have a gold scanner? So we could have two gold scanners. Um, I don't think we really need the pickled nitra. Yeah, we didn't... We haven't gotten any movement speed buffs either, so let's just take the... The gold scanner again. That just means we're going to get a ton of gold. Oh, come on. way so we keep the keep the other bugs from getting to us. And there's a lot of resources just down here on this edge of the map, huh? I mean that's good for us obviously. Alright, um we'll do the fire rate. Okay, this will complete our quest. Awesome. All right, now we're gonna, let's see, there's gotta be a little bit more resources elsewhere. Otherwise, we're just gonna kind of, kind of farm XP. The bosses are here, so let's try to farm as much XP as we can while, while we're here. 188 gold now, that's incredible. Yeah, let's just run through all this. Well, let's get our loot bugs and let's just run through the mines. Okay, we're gonna take that armor. So let's see how much gold we have. We have 197. I wanna see how much we get just for kind of like mining through here. A lot, like we got like 10 gold. Not quite ten gold. Oh yeah, we got we got more than ten gold. It just for some reason it didn't calc it didn't add into our total yet. That was a lot of gold just for mining that little area. Okay, let's get all the XP now. Okay, let's do you. Let's see if we can get a, a overclocked extra coil or extra beam. I guess extra coil makes sense too. Okay, we're gonna do the damage terrain though. No. Yeah. Let's do the damage terrain. That'll just help us mine through everything a little quicker. Okay, so normally I would kind of take this HP, but we're not. I'm gonna take this guy because let's start getting this up a little bit more too. Okay, now we're gonna farm all this XP. We're gonna do the damage, and it's gonna do shocking. You can do the burning. I did a bur plasma burning build. That sucks. <laughs> the the plasma burning is not good. I do not recommend it. Uh, the electric is probably a little bit better because we're at least probably we're at least gonna be putting crit damage on them. Um. So that's for sure going to be the better route to go if you pick between those ones. Uh, we'll do the pickup radius. Okay, we'll do you, and then we'll probably do the damage one. We'll do the damage and reload. Level-wise, we're doing pretty good. Uh, okay, let's do the reload speed. There's still a lot of XP on the board for us, too. Yeah, we'll do 
this guy. Oh man, that guy bounced right into me. Alert. Threat level increasing. What's hitting that? Is the, oh that juggernaut's hitting that. Okay, we'll do the reload. What would be ideal for the fire for this fire burster is if we get piercing for our first overclock. That would be absolutely amazing if that's what shows up here. Um, we're gonna do. I'm gonna do the pickup radius here. We're still doing. We're doing pretty good level wise. I've been higher, but 43 is pretty good for 42. Okay, let's do... I'm going to keep doing the weapons. We're going to focus mainly on the weapons here. Alright, we'll do damage. I don't think we're going to reach 50, but we might. This boss is almost dead, but there's a lot of XP sitting here. Okay, there goes the boss. Okay, we're gonna head back. Okay, um, I'm gonna take that HP, but I'm gonna head back down here. <laughs> I'm glad I took that HP because we took a lot of hits right there. But I really wanted to head down. Okay, we'll do that pickup radius. Okay, so we hit 48. We might be able to hit 50. Get yourself onto that drop part. It's about to head out. Oh no, we we got on. 224 gold. Uh since I do have so much gold, I am going to heal. I wish the unions would help me pay for this. All right, let's do I mean, we might as well as just buy all these good upgrades. I'm going to take this movement speed too. Something like this. Um let's take this and overclock him. So that's going to give us insane fire rate. We'll take the range. The range is really only going to matter. The range really is only that great for the coil gun. Um, We're going to reroll these. I'm pretty much just going to take whatever weapon upgrades show up here. Okay, so hopefully we get piercing. Piercing is going to be the best bet here. No piercing, that's okay. We'll do... I don't think I'm going to do fire because we're pretty much... We have three kinetic weapons. Um, so we'll take the fire rate and reload here. And then we'll take... Since we have just 18, we'll do... That's fine doing that one. And then we'll... Yeah, I guess we'll take the XP game for our last of gold. We're just getting a ton of gold. That was probably one of the... The most amount of gold I've had playing this game. This is gonna okay, we'll be do this. Too bad we, I would love to see like a nitra miner too, <laughs> or a nitra scanner, that would be, that would be awesome. What we really want to see though, some extra beam upgrades for, um, for these weapons, some legendary beam upgrades. Not just the overclocks, I want to see actual legendary upgrades. Look how much gold we have already, 110. Did I just take 85 damage from that explosion? Holy cow. Um, small chance to find XP? Uh, sure. I guess we're a mining build now. We should get mining speed if we see it. Prepare to fight for your life. The big swarm is approaching. 
I'm not. I'm definitely not against taking all this mining stuff for gold, nitra, and now XP. All right, you're already overclocked, so let's focus on the other weapons now. I hate how these man. I hate how these guys just constantly hit you. They're not really that easy to kill, too. They have a lot of HP. Surprisingly amount of a lot of HP. The swing's heading your way. Load up. Oh, there's a magnet. Yes. Okay. Magnets are great. We're going to get that last, though. Jeez, we already have 203 gold. Take a bunch of hits there. All right, we haven't completed our quest yet. I honestly, it almost seems, I almost seem like I'm in better. I'm gonna re-roll these. I almost seem like I'm in better shape, um, just mining than trying to even bother completing this quest. Right? <laughs> because of how much gold we get. We're gonna complete the quest though. We're only two mushrooms away. I said we're gonna keep mainly doing weapon upgrades. Red level keeps increasing. You need to work faster. Okay, this is gonna be the last boss. Let's take that legendary damage. Okay, we killed the other boss. Okay, so let's kill this guy and then we're gonna go get that magnet. Okay, we'll do the critical chance. Don't need to loot all this way around, but... Uh, no stats effect damage. Let's do the coil. All that XP, come to me. Okay, let's do, do it again. Alright, level 56, not bad. After three floors, we have an absolute ton of gold. So let's do the luck. Let's do you. Uh, I'm actually I'm gonna wait for a better upgrade here. This is so this is gonna cost 32. So we can act, actually let's do this then, because I can get this and then I, I can get an 18. I'm not gonna do this one though because I want to get I'm gonna save it Next. for the other weapons. So perfect. Um, let's do the damage, uh, and then we'll do obviously the extra oh beam. God, and then let's re-roll and just get all the... Oh, come on. This is the one time where I have a ton of gold. Just give me gold upgrades. And I honestly don't want XP gains. I don't want... <laughs> I want to see some big damage ones. Damage on beams is fine. Project... See, man, where are the good ones? Guess we can do damage. Uh, we can do critical damage. We'll do. I guess we'll do the XP gain because it's gonna it's gonna cost me twenty eight gold to reroll now. It's I'm probably better off just taking taking the item. You know what would be great is if we also got um. What would make this run work out really well is if we got um. Man, if we got the gold scanner, or not the gold scanner, we have plenty of gold scanners. You know what I'm trying to say. 
Oh man, that mining speed. Let's go. Uh, <laughs> the what? What's the one I'm thinking of? The gold tip bullets. That's the one I'm thinking of. Gold tip bullets. If we could get some gold tip bullets here, my goodness. Now with this 15% mining speed and all the gold we're getting, to there's six, seven, ten, eleven, fourteen. On top of the XP we're getting too. I guess the XP is not really bad. The XP probably wasn't worth taking now that I'm looking at it. I mean, it is proccing a lot, but it takes so much XP for us to level up. Let's kind of make sure we're killing too. I need to <laughs> we need to kill bugs. I can't just farm the whole time. Or can I? Let's get Nitra. I don't need gold nodes, I need nitro nodes. Did I just take like a hundred damage right there? Big swoon detected. Back up and get ready. Alright, no nitro. Did not mean to hit that explosion. Okay, let's do you. We need to get a little bit more. We only have one. This is really our last floor to get some overclocks going, and we only have one gun overclock. Or er, unstable. You know, fully leveled up. Here's some more nitra. That's what we're going to need is nitra to do that. Yeah, we need to get this um, supply drop, too. Would love, would absolutely love to see the gold, the gold tip bullets. All right, we're gonna re-roll this. I'm gonna start re-rolling for uh, upgrades here. Okay, I don't want to kill these bosses. You might, though. Killed one of them. Okay, I can't die here either. Imagine dying right here when I'm this strong. It's because of these, um... It's because of these rollies, man. These rollies really mess with you. Play it safe for a second here. And then we're gonna go get that supply drop. Okay, we'll do... I'm gonna prioritize you. Alright, ooh, damage for every HP we are missing. What are we at right now? 92% damage. Wait. <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. Did I, did I pick the armor? Oh, it was armor. Dang it. <laughs> I looked at the wrong thing. 83 armor. That Okay. Dang it. <laughs> I, don't, I just instantly thought that was going to be the, the damage one. Alright, whatever. All right, is that everybody dead? Okay, let's do you. You're only one away from being overclocked. <laughs> that was so risky. <laughs> Just barely made it on. All that, I think, for one Nitra. 322 gold. Okay, we're, well, we're definitely going to do a heal. Um, We'll do two on you. Let's do... What's our critical... Our critical chance isn't really... Man. Our critical chance is really low, because we didn't get any of the critical items. 
This one makes nothing for me here. Let's okay, we can do. We can do you. Oh man, we didn't get the piercing. That's rough. I really wanted to get the piercing. That that was that's why we picked this gun. Uh, since we didn't get piercing though, I am gonna do the twenty five percent damage to all other weapons. We can take. I have so much gold, so now we'll just just spend like all our gold here. But on critical chance, we're so low. I'm gonna go with this. I'm feeling lucky. Critical damage, man. If only we had better. Okay, we'll do the range. Of something like we'll do this. that. I'm feeling lucky. Okay, we'll do the damage to all, and then that's it. Okay, let's hope that we can get. Man, we only have one overclocked weapon. We're level 62 and we only have one overclock. We have a bunch of our weapons all leveled up, though. I think that's part of the problem. We didn't really focus on getting another one, but that's totally fine. I'm not, like, objective to any of that. We're going to get this Nitra just in case. I'm going to get all the resources still because there's still one more. Um, there's still one more crate for us to get, and it could be gold tip bullets. It could be Nitra powder. It could be pickled Nitra. <laughs> it could be any of those. I guess what I'm hoping for is maybe the gold tip bullets because that could give us a huge damage increase. Okay, I'm not trying to mine you, I was trying to get around you. And plus, I want to get gold for re-rolling so I can try to get, um... Try to get upgrades for weapons we want to see. Because we're only one away from this, uh, Shard Diffractor. We're a couple away from... Our Coil Gun. from you, okay. Alright, let's go get the supply drop. Oh, there's rock! Okay, we're gonna re-roll these. Um... Let's re-roll these. Man. I want to... I want the... Sh just want one shard diffractor. What is happening here? Thank you. Okay, and we'll take the F3 beans. That was all I wanted. Luckily, we had just an absolute ton of gold. Okay, we're going to have to circle around for this. Needless to say, five beans is super good. I wish we could. I wish we could get this uh, coil gun overclock too, though. All right. Ooh. <laughs> What's our movement speed? Do we want to take this? That's going to give us a hundred and twenty percent damage, or we just take the thirty percent crit chance. Yeah, we're in trouble. All right, let's do... Let's re-roll. Legendary damage. Shoot. Okay. Odds of us getting this other weapon overclocked are really, really low. So let's do the damage on that. To, I mean, we'll, we'll probably kill him. I just need to, I just need to play the movement a little bit right here. 
You know, when he jumps, we move. Try to get him in my beams. We should be strong enough, too, to where we kind of kill everything. He's going down so quick, too. Just even with this slow movement speed, it doesn't even matter. He's just kind of getting shredded. Get him in all those beams. Yep, you're done, dude. Finish him off. He's done. All right, we did it. <laughs> we cleared. I mean, I knew we would. This, There wasn't any doubt in my mind that we were going to finish this. Uh, this build is insanely strong. We we had a close call there though at the at one point. Uh, well, yeah. Let's just let's just do you. We did have a close call, but otherwise, this is just an insanely strong build. Really, really strong. Or the stronger weapons in the game. Um, you could replace that burst fire with a bunch of other guns. Um. Like, look at the damage. They all did pretty good damage, too, considering they were all... We didn't really power up one over the other. The burst fire really misses out, though, because we didn't get piercing on that. Um, that was the main reason why I took burst fire, because I wanted to get the piercing overclock, and we didn't see that. So that's unfortunate. But otherwise, you could replace this gun with a lot of things, like the... You could even do the Seismic Repulsor would be a really good one to put with this. Um, what else? You could do the Breach Cutter. You could do the Guided Rocket Launchers. Uh, there's, a lot, there's a lot of good weapons you could switch this one out for. But I think these are three of the better weapons to run, especially if you're running one of these maps like Hollow Bow or or salt pits where there's a lot of where your shard diffractors can really come into use by bouncing off a lot of walls and hitting enemies multiple times so this is it's a pretty sweet build and then obviously the thunderhead is just one of the best weapons in the game even with the nerf the sooner you get piercing the better just getting piercing i think kind of guarantees you a, a win so there we go a uh, solid run very strong uh we didn't really get a ton of dps items though and we actually did really <laughs> this could have been a so much better run because we got um I feel like we had, I feel like we actually got kind of bad weapon upgrades. We didn't see any legendary beams. We didn't see any legendary beams. Um we got a lot of general upgrades early in the game. And then we actually didn't get any of the really high damaging um We didn't really get we didn't get any like damage damage items here other than other than the pickled nitro at the end we didn't get the crit goggles we didn't get the divers manual the gold tip bullets would have been perfect so yeah this wasn't even in this wasn't even a fully optimized run but we still did pretty good all right everybody that's gonna be it thank you so much for watching if you enjoy these videos please drop a like please subscribe to the channel we do d a lot of deep rock galactic right now but we play all types of in mostly indie games i'll check out AAA games every once in a while but for the most part it's, it's indies it's roguelikes it's these smaller type games that a lot of games that a lot of people don't necessarily showcase because i am an indie game lover that's what we did on my twitch channel i would constantly just play all these indie games people had never heard of and they, they really liked them, so I'm glad to be continuing doing this on my YouTube channel. So there we go, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day.